Welcome to Curse of the Crimson Throne. Finally, we're getting started. A little bit, a little bit late, but that's not my fault. Don't blame me. Session twenty-one. Yeah, this is fault either. Reminder. Session twenty. <laughs> Session twenty-one. Everybody, go to two hero points. Whoever's on webcam. Uh Boop. Yes, red. I already had one. You already had one. Do you want to get another one for a recap of last session? Do you remember what happened last session, Red? I do, kind of. I'll give you the opportunity to go to two hero points if you give me a recap. Go. All right. If you can show me the map so I can remember the damaged street names. Thank you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right. So... Before we all met together, if I remember correctly, we were sleeping in a, yeah, like I was sleeping in the drink hall while others did that and some of their own homes. We then had to investigate something. I can't remember what it was. I mean, it was the rat things, where rats. But beforehand, we met Festus, talked to him a bit. Durkin didn't like it, but we had to. And he found we found some corpses in the alleyway. It was that was weird. that was way later. Okay, never mind then. We did the. We I did don't the remember then. First. We did the sewer first, guys. We did the sewers first. I think. God, now I'm confused. Yeah. Sewers, sewers. Uh, dealt with uh, the uh, the were rat guy, uh, and got got an agreement to for the were rats to uh, <laughs> help clean up bodies in. As respectful a manner as possible, and if they are going to, uh, if they find any like identifying items, heirlooms, things like that, to turn those into the uh, the the city guard so that the, they can be returned to the families once this is all over and people Indeed. are like, where are my where are my loved ones? They can at least know that their loved ones died due to the plague. And then Durgan. And then, after the whole wear rats thing, we made Festus talk to him about killing his rival. No, we did not know that. That was a joke. We found some corpses in an alleyway into a broken building. Durkin decided to see if they were alive, and it was an ambush of the undead. But they lasted less than a, yeah, two rounds and died pretty quickly. Then we went in, investigated the place, talked a bit, killed another undead or two. And um, there was a cellar, but Papa said, no, that's not a cellar, that was just a drawing. That was the most important thing, was that there was a drawing yeah. of, a, like, a hatch on the floor. It was the employee bathroom, I think, was what we decided. Yeah. yeah. And we got some letters. I don't really remember what it said exactly. Oh, another important thing. <clears throat> I think it was either Yava or Isabel. They found a door... To the main street. Yava did. Yes. Yeah. Yava found a door. She was really, really scared of the door, but it was just a street door. Um, and then you guys found a lockbox or a key to a lockbox. And then we ended the session with Jasper coming up to Yava and being like, Hey, the Carowinds are having a party. They're having it right now. They've been having it for a for today and i think the family of let me see the names again uh oh god one second please i'll find it i'll find it he mentioned i think lady T tula al nasa and lady uberto al nasa are gonna lord uberto al nasa are gonna be there and it might be a good opportunity to go and you all found it strange that there was a Party in the middle of a plague. Party in the middle of a plague. Yes. Plague party. Yes. Plague party. Plague party. PP, if you will. Matt, are you already asleep? That seems likely. He said no. Okay. All right. I said no, but I was like, I forgot to unmute myself. Okay. Um. So, at this point in time. We're going to head towards the manor. 
which yes. is down here on Shoreline Way. We also found that. So it takes a it takes a, a brisk thirty minute walk on your way to the manor. Anything you wish to discuss on the way, or should I just start you out there? Uh, well, I mean, yeah, real quick, what's our plan to get in? We don't have one. All right. Well, I mean, I'm I'm willing to just you know saying say hi. Can can we come in? You know, why not? We're respectable. I mean, some of us. Um, Yava is still currently wearing her maid's outfit from the, uh, uh what are they called? Arcona's. Arcona's, house. yeah. Uh, could, w do I know if the maid's uniforms are pretty similar between houses? Roll me a, we call knowledge macro, please. I would also probably want, would like to recall knowledge because Aiden's trying to just remember who actually ran the house and to think about what kind of outfits they rub shoulders with, like okay. companies and shit. Yava Natural 1, no idea if the maid outfit will help you out in this situation. Aiden, where's your recall knowledge macro? Uh, oh, God. Recall knowledge? Oh, I don't have a recall knowledge because I don't need to use it. I'll set it up. Hold on. Recall knowledge. I can just set it if you want. No, no, you're good. I got you. You rolled a Mommy. natural three. Wow. We don't know anything about so, these people. Yeah, I'm... You know what? Fuck it. I am having trauma from last... From yesterday. Let's hear a point. At, let's see what happens. Okay, we're manually... Let's get the bad rolls out of the way. And we're gonna go ahead and uh, hit the button again here. For a natural six... Hey, at least to three more in society. Uh, you know, there are nobles, you know, that you'd either have to be dressed up a little fancier, a little fine clothes here, bod here and there, or dressed down. But are they just going to accept random a random party of six people? Jasper seems to think so. He's already got his like uh servant's outfit. Regardless, uh, are they going to accept a party of six people being like, "Hey, we want to be a servant"? You know, we want to we want to serve. You might want to either dress up or just barge in there like you are. But it's, it's a and, bit, hmm. you know, I'm really not loving the idea of uh, just walking in there as servants. I don't want to be stuck there all night serving hard d'oeuvres to a bunch of stuck up pricks. Well, then, I suppose, if we're going to try to get in on our own merits, people need to clean up. Aiden, looks at, hey, Aiden immediately looks at a Duggan when he says clean up. I ain't going to leave my DACA. Neither my crust spro behind. Do you know how much money I used in it? I, I didn't I didn't say leave them behind. I said wash. Look nice. Look, wear yeah. nice clothing. Oh. Present well, this is my nice clothing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's what I suspect. Look, are we Look, are we going to look, do we expect these people to be dangerous? This is the, it's a pretty simple yes or no uh, question. Mm, what do you mean listen. by dangerous? Oh, no. As in is in if someone got if someone walked in there on their lonesome, are they going to be sacrificed to a goat god? Certainly not. Well, I mean, Yava's already got the experience. She's got the outfit. I don't know if the outfits are the same among houses or not, but, you know. She could be our end. She could be the eyes and ears that hopped in. Because between between an assassin, a goblin, a very old bitter man, and a dwarf, I feel like Yava's got the best chance. Oh, uh, I could probably I could probably blend blend with the servants and get in, and I have a feeling that Caden could probably break in or sneak in. Probably no problem. I also have a feeling that Priz would with her connections to the temple, would probably be welcomed in. Wait. It's just Didn't we, Dagen, didn't we and... give Kate in a potion to turn him invisible? 
Oh, I also have, could turn somebody invisible. Okay, work. All right, well, but all right, well, I could always stay out front. I could case out who's coming in and coming out, see if there's anyone of note. <sighs> Alright, I mean... Man. Go ahead, Aaron. I, I was... I, I think I think we've got the workings of, of some plans. Some of us will try to talk our way in. Others can sneak in. And Durgan, good luck. It's, it will be invisible. <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't need my luck. I could just walk in with all the issues. What they're gonna do to me? Stop me. I'll just show this part here, and they will let me in. Yeah, they, entirely they will stop you. Yes, that is what I am suggesting. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah Durgan, remember, these are like, these are nobles in the middle of a, uh, of a pandemic that has just followed the assassination of a king, which was followed by riots. Um, they're going to have some pretty beefed up security there. There is no doubt in my mind that you will see quite a few guards, probably old veterans. Or very keen mercenaries that are looking to get a start in their career. Right. They will gladly draw your blood to advance the, their careers. Oh, you don't have to worry about me. Trust me, I have a way in. And if you hear any noises from the outside, don't worry about it. And we're going to look at Duggan, and he's immediately going to light up a cigarette. <laughs> I'll subtract a cigarette from you, Aiden. All right. So, I mean, Yama and I try to talk our way in. Caden and Durgan try to sneak in, and Aiden's going to stay outside. Yep, I'll, I'll <laughs> fake out the people, and if it, look, if shit hits the fan, I don't know, stop making bird sounds. But I feel like if shit does hit the fan, I'll notice when people stop piling out or piling in. All right. Uh, and if uh, only some of us make it in, uh, first order of business is find a, a servant's side door and open it. Mm -hmm. You guys make your way to the Carowind Manor. The outside, festooned with cinder bear, the garlands, and bright red drapery. The limestone facade of Caroline Carolyn Manor faces Shoreline Way. Um, wait, can we can we pick up a quick item on the way? Yeah, what do you want? Uh fancy gloves. Fancy gloves. You can stop yeah, fancy by gloves. a couple packets of cigarettes. You wanna buy a couple packets of cigarettes, Aiden? Uh they've increased the price due to the pandemic, so they're gonna cost one gold per pack. That's me. I'll take it. I knew it. <laughs> I'm gonna keep doing this to the entire campaign, Aiden. Yeah, and it's like when we win, the prices will finally go back down to like a cup or a piece. That's the whole reason you're doing this, right? Yeah. <laughs> 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 um, a stately guard gabled the state along Shoreline Way. Carolyn Manor has a meticulously manicured garden. But as you enter the front door, or as you pass to the front door, something seems a little off to you all. It's Durgan, Seeker Perception. <clears throat> it's quiet, Durgan. Too quiet. Where the hell are the gods? Oh my god. <laughs> Damn it, I had Ioma Day, would you f Are you trying to fucking kill me? Uh Matt, I, I actually Matt, felt Matt, 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 oh. mute yourself, what? please. Mute yourself. What? Oh. No, that's Oh, that were you in character. Oh, that was in that character? Was the... Oh, shit. I yeah, was that talking... was in character. I thought you were talking <laughs> to Kelly. I was like... No, that was in character. <laughs> Bro, that was in character. I'm sorry. Went... That's like... That's like a... That is like one way to just... <laughs> Thanks, Bob. All right, I'll reset. I'll be like... Oh, my guy, home today. Are you trying to fucking kill me? I actually felt my heart stop for a second. <laughs> 
Wait, what did he say? He shouted, <laughs> where are the guards? Oh he my god. That's oh my god. All right, I'm sorry, man. I'll give you a hero point for for that for that. Uh, Matt. There you go. Uh, all right. Well, um, oh, not... I should also say it's too quiet. I'm sorry. I'm I'm back. Any response? No response. In fact, I'll push on the door a little bit. It's locked. Hmm. Well, I'm going to go over here and look around and see if I can see any other ways in. If anything happens that's illegal while I'm out of eyesight, I wouldn't Chris, know about it. As you round the corner, the sickly sweet smell of blood reaches your nostrils as an open window seems to be wafting some sort of stench from inside. As you round around the corner, Priz... Yeah. You see bodies, bodies, uh, oh. dozens of them, all wearing noble garbs. And roll me secret perception, Priz. That's about it. Uh, does Mayday smell anything? She can roll with a public voice. perception. I mean, just within thirty feet. Is there any 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 creature that she smells? Yep, roll me a public perception for Mayday. Mayday lay, lays out a little rumble. She smells something in there. Uh, within 30 feet of her? Yeah. It would now be hidden to me, so I would know which square it's in. It would be hidden to Mayday. Yeah, yeah, right. Mayday sees something, smells something be behind the window cell, basically. Okay. Points. Uh, then, yeah, I'm going to come back around, motion for everybody to huddle up. Hey! Hey! Everybody, come here! Yeah, 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 w what's up? What did you find? Bodies and an open window. There's something in the room. Mayday can smell it. I couldn't see it. Well, I'm surprised on charts out with this voice I had before. What? They didn't find a door. I didn't hear it. Yeah, I heard you yell. No. I just... Alright. Jargon. As you approach the window, I'm going to pause the game for a second. <gasps> Because as you see this thing, clearly with your earlier perception check, I'm gonna play a little. I'm gonna play a little clip of something that you guys are gonna enjoy. Uh, I think everybody but Yawa is gonna enjoy this clip. Oh no! Something. Oh, what is this? Something grim. I bet. If they go, that that party of, you know, feasting will be on the massacre eating the nobles. Wow. <laughs> yeah! That the undead will try to eat the nobles over there because it's feasting. Yeah, I'll take that bet. <laughs> Sorry, I just, I just recorded it for posterity. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> Durgan, Boy. you see an yeah, undead uh, eating the noble. Do you remember the bit? I think I won. What are you talking about? So come over here. The noble is being feasted on. By what? One zombie. Well, by a He's in As you One peer zombie. through the oh. window. You see something that the others didn't see. You see this gentleman lying on the ground, completely dead. Pustules covering his face, although they don't look to be real pustules, but getting munched on by a zombie.
Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Okay. I forgot how to adjust. He has pustulars on him. Um, you can roll me medicine check for that, by the way. But Jasper's like, what's going on? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. What? Yeah, they're fake pustules, Yava. They are not they're fake. Yeah, somebody kind of carved the knot onto him to make it appear that they died of blood veil, but they didn't die of blood veil. Fully mask of the Red Death here. Hmm. Yava, what, how are you reacting? Just out of curiosity. Yeah. Can you hear me? Okay, there we go. It's picking up. Yeah, Yava is doing the, uh, you know, fight or fight or freeze. She's like freezing. She Her brain is not comprehending exactly what she's seeing. I mean. And she's kind of just, what? I, I know. I know. I know it's shocking that Durgan was right. And I know it sucks that you owe him 50 gold, but we still need to search for survivors. Right. Yeah. Yes, of course. Um, okay, Priz. Mm. What would um, what would cause someone to? I don't even know what I'm asking right now. If you look at the bodies, they look like they have blood veil, but it looks it looks wrong. It looks off. It looks. I'm not really an expert on on diseases. That'd be more. Isabel's thing, but you mean somebody faked it? I don't know. You'll well. I'm Look, we can worry know. about we can worry about what's going on soon. But for now, what we need to do is we need to clear this house. Any any shamblers that are inside, we need to we need to take care of them because if they get out of this little manor. They just there is enough of them in there to wipe out a full party of nobles. Likely their guards too. That means if they get out, they'll do a hell of a lot worse to anyone in the lower class areas or lower middle class areas. All right, it'll be a solution for this. If you have a torch, we burn the place down. We're looking for survivors. Clear the window. You guys can walk through the open window, and we're not going to make these shamblers a threat. Technically, they're meant to be, but I think we've handled them last session, and they were not a threat. So, Caden, I can put you back with the party if you'd like. Uh, do you want to report what you saw, Caden? I've seen in the, I guess, dining room, there's probably about four of these shamblers. And, like, a dozen dead bodies. So I've seen about six total. Yeah. All right. Anyone alive? So you guys can walk Sorry, through the what window. Was that, Matt? The window. Yeah, go ahead, Matt. Did you see anyone alive, Caden? Uh, I have not seen any live bodies. All right. Well, uh, charge. So, uh, I'm going to raise a shield and use it to protect myself and Mayday and charge through this window uh, and just blast through and uh, land inside. Go ahead and move yeah. yourself through the window there. I think. Oh, let me move. Let me move that window. There we go. Uh, again, zombies, not a threat. We're not going to roll initiative for these zombies. You can just flavor ripping them so, to pieces. Yes. Yeah. Moves through and uh, just, just beheads it. Uh, cracks to the ground as you guys slide through open windows it is just a pungent smell of death and decay freshish blood they seem to have been killed with Yava's medicine check probably three or four hours ago potentially and, and Frizzle just yeah, move to here to and like take up a defensive position as they come in uh, there is 
a corpse or a zombie that looks also extremely familiar to Yava as well. A female zombie. No, oh, no. That looks a little bit like this. No, she no. Forward. Mm. Okay, wait, praise, 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 praise. Uh, okay, can we he can we like heal them? Can we can we undo this? Can I dispel magic? Can I? Can you bless them just before you before you um, hit them? Um. This is Aiden's area of expertise, actually, since I'm pretty sure I flavored him as, like, dealing with undead before. Like, I have a thing for push back the undead. Would I be able to do a recall knowledge for do you have knowing if lore? this type of... Do you shoot, do you I don't have undead lore, but I do, I do... I did have, like... I did flavor my uh, background I'm gonna, for... Um... I'm gonna give you undead lore, yeah? Oh, hell yeah. Can I roll undead lore, then? Yeah. Makes sense you have... My G. Yeah. Pablo, there's only darkness here. Uh, there's only darkness. There's only darkness here. Oh, there's probably a wall that's kind of fucky there. Sorry, the walls aren't perfect. There we go. A Hop 30? Up. Yeah, you know some stuff. Yeah, these undeads had... Th their souls have long left their body, Aiden. They're just but a, a husk of a shell. Seems Yava. to be reanimated. The yes. Y Yava, there is nothing left in there to bring back. They're gone. This is just defilement of what has been left behind by the soul. You guys I'm, are... I'm sorry, but there really isn't anything we can do here. The zombies are somewhat aggressive, but you're parrying them and making sure they don't attack you as you guys decide on what to do with them. Yes? Yeah, I mean... Uh, yeah, I, I, don't, I don't think we can... We can only bring back the bodies once they're not animated and then She'll swing on, on the shambler. On the shambler that Java recognized. Durkin would shoot that one in the head. It's fine. Uh, you guys can... Oh, Chris died! Chris died. Yeah, why, why did you kill me? I didn't. Who killed me? I didn't kill you. Did you add Somebody dying to yourself accidentally? I didn't, I didn't do anything. I just killed some zombies, my dude. I just deleted no. some zombies. <laughs> Bro, Red Priz really died to trigger underscore hurt over here. Get a load of this guy. <laughs> uh, there... Priz, you see some stairs leading up and what seems to be a maniacal giggle coming from upstairs. Well, there's definitely something upstairs. I don't know and if maniacal there... equals survivor. And there was a lot of shambles here. Jurgen, do you headshot a couple of them? Again, well, I... I assume as yeah, I just imagine shoot one cadence takes the other one, and we will clear them out fast. You clear them out from this room easily enough, but the giggle continues. Priz, what are you doing? Well, uh, I'm just gonna guard here if they want to clear this floor, and then once we're ready to go up, mm. Yava, are you okay? I don't know. Did you, did, were they friends of yours? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I, um, I worked for them for four or five years and they were just really lovely people. You see all the people that are dead, I should probably describe it, that seem to be nobles of some sort from different houses. Uh, all of them had this one thread in common, that they were a bit richer. But, Yava, as you look at these nobles, roll me a recall knowledge macro. Another issue over here, Pablo. It's fine. Yava, just... well done on your recall knowledge. They were nobles, but they weren't the richest of nobles, right? They were like the middle or middle lower noble class. This seems to have been orchestrated somehow. Can I just kind of scanning over the crowd, can I pick out some of the richer nobles who are missing? So like the Arconas Arconas aren't there. Arconas are not here and neither are the super rich people. Sorry guys, one second, one second. I need to refresh anyways. I am... While this is happening and Pablo's paused, I'm gonna continue. 
Look, Yava, at the at the end of this, once this is all sorted, sorted, we can take the bodies out and we can burn them. At least give them some sort of farewell other than just rotting on a stone floor. Yeah. Has anyone seen a, a, a boy that they had a son? He's about like eight years old. Has anybody seen a boy in here? Oh, you yeah, don't tell me there's see kids. a couple of noble kids also in the crowds. Oh, fuck. But as you look closer, Yava, if somebody points them out and you look closer, don't recognize them. Okay, all right. Um, good, 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 good. That's good. I mean, it's horrible. It's it's so horrible, but... It's good that it's not people you know. Yeah. Jasper yeah. is also here, and he's like, is, it, is he around? Did they, bring, did they uh, bring the kid here as well? I don't know. I don't see him. I'm heading upstairs. You guys make your way towards the source of the maniacal giggling. And I'm going to go ahead and put you guys on another map. It's a little bit of a rough map because there is no walls here, but I'm okay with it because it would have just taken way too long to set up the walls. Uh, and we're going to go ahead and uh, put you guys on this map here. One second, please. Yava and Caden. No. Wait, who am I missing? Prez, Yava, Caden, Durgan. Jasper? Jasper as well, and put Jasper in here. Oh, Durgan, there we go. All right. Uh, rearrange yourself slightly in marching order. I just put you guys randomly. Um, so put yourself up front if you're up front. Well, which Where's direction? Where's the stairs? Uh, yeah. Going, going to the right. Sorry, going to the right. Oh uh, yeah. More dead nobles. Uh, I'll move Aiden behind here. Oh. oh. Ah. I'll put Aiden last because uh, as you guys hear a giggling coming from the other side of the landing. <laughs> oh, more people come to play? Oh, that's amazing. Oh, hey! You're Varician! She points at you, Yava, as you make your way up. Is she speaking in Varician or is she speaking no, in she's common? she's speaking in common, yeah. The... Yes, good day. What's happened here? What's what are you doing here? Oh, just my lovely, lovely Rolf asked me to do something, and I did. Look at Is all this the abomination bodies. yours. Abomination. Why would you call this an abomination? It's so pretty. Look at all that red. It's ugly. It should be blue. If someone asks you if this abomination is yours, you say no. Uh, and uh, I'm 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 ready to charge this. Bitch. We're gonna roll initiative. Um, I will remove the zombie. You know, I think the reason why they're asking if this abomination is yours is, well, let's face it, lady. You're not a sight for. You are definitely not a sight for sore eyes. Any of you Varishan or half Varishan? Rolf was looking for people. <laughs> I already gave him the kid, and another servant. Oh. Hold on. I'll get up. I'll get up onto my PC for for um for initiative. What was that, Yaba? Wait, 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 wait. Which what kid? Who? What kid? And which servant? Oh, he had such pretty blue eyes, but that can hide the varician oh, in him. You fucking bitch. Okay, she's ready. She's gonna kill him. <laughs> <laughs> kill her. Roll initiative, everybody, please. Ooh, I rolled a nat one on her initiative. Get out of here. And Yava rolled first. Uh, guys, move yourselves up on the stairs or on the second floor, please, and then we roll. Then we can start the battle. So, uh, Bridge should be in front. She would always be in, yeah, in the front. Yeah, yeah. Row. Hold on, let me just figure out my inventory real quick. Range in criminal 60 feet. 
All good while while we're waiting here. Yava, what are we doing? Uh, why are the, hold on? Is that really fifty five feet away? I guess it is. Let me um. Yeah, that's fine. That's absolutely fine. Yava, what are you doing? Um. Hang on real quick. Sorry. I normally have time to look at my spells before it's my turn. Um, yeah, all right. Okay. So I need to move. Uh, how far is that? 30 feet. Cool. All right. And I'm going to cast... I'm going to use my new spell. I'm going to cast blood. Ah, she's a, she probably has a really good will save. All right. I'm going to do bon mo. So that's one action to move, one action to bon mo. You won't be able to cast a spell, yeah? I won't be able to cast a spell. Damn it. All right. Let's just try it. That has the incapacitation trait, which means that if she's higher level than you, which she is, she gets a success on a failure. But she's still blinded until the next turn begin, which is not bad. Uh, until the until its next turn begin, she's still off guard to everybody until her turn, and she's pretty low yep. on initiative, so not too shabby, Yava. Ah, I can't see. Oh, oh, it's so pretty. Uh, you can sense she's a little off her rocker here. Yava, solid. That's your turn. Durgan. Well, first, hunt prey. Hunt prey, indeed. He then shoots. Ooh. I sense that. I hear a point does. Okay. That'll hit. Roll me damage. Ow! Woo! Yeah, take that, you ugly bitch. He then reloads, and that will be his turn. Solid. Do you want a running reload? No. No? These zombies are whatever. I hate I yeah. don't know why. You won't run away no yet. All right. Fair enough. Praise, what are you doing? Uh yeah, I mean I think uh for this turn it'll be pretty easy. Uh pray for uh some guidance from Ioma Day as the uh sword in her hand glows and then uh, she uh, I'm going to Cavalier's Charge. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Why can't I grab it? What's going on? That's weird. Okay. So Cavalier's Charge uh, I move, that's 20 feet. Uh, 40 feet. Uh, I will swing remembering that I actually do get a plus one circumstance bonus. Mm. Guidance I will use and to just barely hit. That hits. hit. Oof. Dice rolls are not great. Uh, and then with the remaining movement, uh, we'll back up uh, to cover Yaba. Excellent. Aiden Lang. Oh, ready. Oh. Oh. Why isn't my gun loaded? It should Hold on, I just have to be back. I don't know why that was yeah, yeah. loaded. Yeah, you're good. All right. Uh, first action, I'm going to move over yonder. Second action, uh, targeter. It's going to be, of course, to buy the stratagem. Mm -hmm. By the effect. A nine. Plus my intelligence bonus, which is 
So I've got 14, 15, so 23. Fuck it, I think it's 21 minutes. Let's find out if a 23 is our AC. That's stupid. Oh, off guard. Oh, oh, she good. will nimble dodge as a reaction. As she will twirl away. Like she can she even see it? Ah, I, think, I don't think she can nimble dodge this one. She can't see it coming. She's blinded, so that's fine. You can see the attacker is one of the uh, one of the requirements. So that'll hit. Roll me damage. All right. Oh, this blindness is really screwing me over. Yeah, and then I have one more action, right? Uh, is this your lead? Was this your lead? Because then that would have been a free action. I honestly can't remember. I know we said we were gonna. I was gonna start writing down my lead, but I. I would assume in a manner full of dead bodies could have been a lead for an investigation. <laughs> so you still have two actions. Thanks, Actually, no, you have one, uh, no, action, I you have one action. One action, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and then last action. Uh, he is going to... On mine. So, the diplomacy check. What do you tell her? Uh... Well, that's a failure. Fair Hold on, enough. let me track one little point because I love to hear a point from the start when I re-roll. No, I gave you, I gave you one earlier. Don't worry, I gave you one. Oh, you gave me one earlier. Well, then I'll just add that, that back and re-roll. Still a failure. I can see to full DC. By the way, am I? Nope. That's because it says Aiden Lang. Yeah, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. That's your turn, Aiden. Yeah. Okay. Oh, you guys are feisty, aren't we? She will blink and her blindness will go away. Oh my. Ooh, I like the Varician. I'm going to keep her. She's going to move here. Uh, and she had a bow on her, so she will strike at Yava with. Oh, uh, let me actually. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I'll strike at Yava. Ooh, gotta keep you alive for Rolf. And then she's gonna go into the next room. So, hmm, I really should have put walls here. I'm sorry. But she's gonna go into the next room, putting her out of sight from everybody. Yes? Caden, what are we doing? Caden's going to first action stride to 30 feet. Mm -hmm. And then he's going to Use another action to use another 30 feet. You can certainly do that. <clears throat> can I go there? Peekaboo. <laughs> and then he's going to strike. Jasper, in the meantime, is screaming at Yava. What did she say? Oh, I didn't hey, just... target. Sorry. She's got him. They've got him. He's They've gone. Got They've got him. him. Are you kidding me? I'm going to kill yes, that bitch. No, like, we have to find him. We have to get her. Wait, wait, wait. Don't kill her. We got to interrogate her. That is a miss, Caden, unfortunately. Yes, with a 17. So can I reroll? You can right click and reroll. Make sure you unselect double slice on there. Yeah. You have double slice selected on your toggle. Oh, I do. Yeah. So just uh, unselect and ro manually subtract a hero point and attack again for me. That's a hit. Almost a crit. Roll me damage. Ooh, the red thing's coming out. That's your turn, Caden. Yava. Uh, reminder, guys, she's behind a wall. You're not able to see her from your vantage point. I only revealed her to Caden. Oh, wait. Um, mm -mm. Okay. So, wait, why is it not giving me... 
<sighs> my boundary is really okay? Okay? struggling. Okay. Yeah, really bad. Okay. Um. Did you refresh by any chance? It I did. Have... Okay. 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 So that was fifteen. I don't even remember what my speed is. 25 30 30 30 okay so that was 15 so i get another 15 Move here with one action uh, can i let's go okay. okay she's still behind a wall um still can't see her i'm gonna have to take another action um yeah all right she's pissed off so yeah oh my gosh Yava's gonna run in over here. Hi. That that was two, and then I'm gonna go ahead and I've got one thing. Um yeah, I guess I'll cast shield on myself. There was so much food in this manner. Durgan. There's still some left. Well, you guys want some? Let me see. I need to see if I can even come all the way over there. Ah, I forgot how to do that. Control click. Well, I can make it. I got the running boots, so. Ooh. Yeah, my. Running is normal speed now. So you will see a... He will use two actions. A fast wolf running. That's 25. Nice. So that's... I think he will stand up here. 65, 60 to get here, yeah. So it's not blocking all the way and he will shoot it right in the face. Perfect. Ow. That'll hit. Roll me damage. Ow! Why are you guys so mean? That's your turn. <clears throat> All right. Well, everybody seems to be going in. Uh, it is lagging hard. Is it really? Why? There's no yeah. like. There's not even a wall on this map or anything like that. That's sorry. Boundaries being All weird. Right. All right. What are we doing? So, everybody's going in. We're going to uh, charge. That's 40, 50, 60, 75, 80. So, that's the path. I'm assuming you're attacking her while you're flanking her. Right? Yep. So, go ahead and I'll off guard her for you. You don't have to move. Uh, if it oh, I needed to actually end my movement up one higher, which I easily had to, to do. I okay. Um, so yeah, I will swing. I just misplaced where that last one was. Mm -hmm. That hits so with all of them without the charge. Damn. Yeah, that misses. Uh well that that has charge in it yeah yeah so that that'll miss yeah even with her flat footed yes even yeah. with her flat footed uh then I will hero point it ah oh. that's a hit for ten damage and then the last action will be to target Yava when I can and uh, lay a hand. We'll get him back, I promise. I can't target at the moment. It's it's lagged super hard. Francisco, has it really been a year since you joined? I just noticed today. Oh, congratulations. It's your one-year anniversary. You. Uh, you get a free session today, by the way, buddy. Yes, oh, happy, happy anniversary. Happy birthday! Uh, we'll heal uh, Yava yeah. here. That okay. is my turn. Uh, I think it's the dice. Every time a die comes out, my foundry is just stops. That's weird. Is everybody else noticing this or just uh, Aaron? 
I don't have any lack. And paying attention, yeah. Okay. Like I haven't noticed a correlation, but I haven't been looking for one. I'll just refresh. Okay. See if that fixes it. Yeah, I'm going to too. She's behind a wall, Aiden. Just a heads up. You can't shoot her from there. And that is only a means of it. I do not I had the reload and I did not have the movement speed to move and attack. Mm -hmm. So I'll just have to move and reload. Okay. And I guess as he goes along, he kind of the reason why he's going so slow is because he just shoves this shambler out of the way and just tries to tip it over the line when he's going. Crunch. Jolistinia. Why are you guys so mean? She's gonna move here. Okay. Keep the keep the Varician alive. Hey, you as she crits on Yava here. No. Uh well, I'm going to uh use the uh reactive strike. I can't act retributive strike. I can't actually hit her, but I can uh Go ahead and click on that. I'll apply champion's resistance on Yava. And is my shield still up? It's still up if you want to shatter it for... I'd resist. like to shatter it. Okay. Hmm. Oh, you silly people with your silly tricks. Ah! That missed. Caden. Aiden's going to stride uh, up to where he can block the view mm. of Yava. And then he's going to uh, double slice. She should not be off guard for this. I'll get rid of that. Yeah, thank you. <clears throat> Let me make sure I'm... There yep, you go. And yep. use a double slice macro, please. That's a hit and a crit. Ooh. Well done. Roll me damage. Combine it. Let's fucking go. Uh, if only she was off guard, she would have taken additional sneak attack damage. But she is frightened one. Oh. Okay, I surrender. She says. Yala, what are you doing? Uh, can I... Can I make like an insight check to see if she actually is surrendering? Yeah, well, let me see your perception. Secret perception. Okay. Uh, uh, you, she, she's smiling, hands up in the air. I don't want to fight anymore. Yeah. Oh, right. Um. Okay. I'm gonna bon mo. Okay. Hit that diplomacy button in chat for me, please. What are you saying? Oh. Um. Uh, he's uh. Oh, uh, sorry. I'm having a hard time thinking. Um, it's okay. You have to. I don't know. Like, I guess, um, hmm. I don't know. I can't think of anything. That's Pablo. okay. I'm That's okay. You don't have like, to. You don't yeah, have to. That's that okay. one. You, yeah, your mother go. dressed you like that, or was that a choice you made? Solid. All right. Last, in the, in last, it, last two I just want to say, Yavo, in the other room, after you say that, you, you, you see, you hear Aiden just go. <laughs> <laughs> Last two actions, Java. Okay. So back to my spells. Um I 
Oh, where did it go? All right. She is a bit of a bad bitch, so you can't lie, like, for real. True. That is a success due to Bon Mo, not a crit success. Well done. What does she do? She gets uh, off guard. Oh, I knew. Did she find a flat check? Ooh. Ah! Hey, it sounds like my head out there. Uh, that's your turn, Yava. Jurgen. Do we need to ask her any question, or should we just kill her? He reloads. No. Sit. Don't kill her. We have to take her live. Get her in the gut. Maybe I should do what I did with her ass. He aims for her knee. This will be a non lethal shot to her knee. Power. Minus two will... to, the, to the attack roll, yes. I will all use the Skyrim joke. Let's not. Go ahead Too and, late. Go ahead and strike her. You got a minus two penalty to the attack roll. Let me just. There we go. Add. That hits by plus. Oh. You know what? She is going to nimble dodge. Whoop. Oh. Missing. She uses a reaction. Oh. Yeah, Sheldon have done that. Now she will get you. He reloads and that's his turn. Uh, was it? Oh, you reloaded, shot and reload. Perfect. Prez. <clears throat> What do you call a blonde elf at a zombie party? Ooh, None what? you can eat on buffet. Because, you know, it's a dumb blonde joke for no reason. Uh, she'll step off. She'll dismount. Uh, she'll give Mayday an order for the second action. Mayday will come over here and will attempt to uh, do a non-lethal takedown strike. Uh The animal companion coming back in clutch once again. Well, we'll find out. Mostly this just I gives believe. me multiple opportunities to uh, make this attack, because now I'm not sharing MAP. No. That's Damn. not going to do it. Uh, she can... That's it for her. Uh, Priz is going to take a non-lethal swing with the uh, sword. So she spins the uh, sword in its uh, to get to the flat. Minus two, and that hits. Yeah, yeah. dodge. Two to fright and no nimble dodge because she just used it. Well done. Ow! I did say I surrender, right? Stop hurting me. I was not lethal. God. You're still hurting mm. me. That's uh that's your turn, Chris? Question mark? Yep. Okay. Aiden Lang. Alright. Aiden walks into the room. This is going to be a non lethal. I can devise a strategy for non lethal, right? Yes, you just had a minus two to your attack roll, basically. All right, then I will devise a stratagem. There is no way in high hell. I rolled a one. I rolled a one. Ain't no dog in it. Nope, 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 nope. We're manually subtracting. You, you can't use a hero point on devise a stratagem because it's already a fortune effect. Yeah, it's. Oh, you're joking. Yeah, sorry, bud. Sorry. Okay, well, that's fine. That was two actions, wasn't it? It's not fine. It's a free action to uh, devise a stratagem. Oh. So. Oh, well then. She is your lead. Can I non-lethal that? <laughs> you no. cannot non-lethal Electric Arc. Fuck. I'm sorry. Um. 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 You can still do it anyway, if you want to. Uh, 
No, because I don't want to kill her, because that's just, like, that. that is literally not what I'm going for. If I can't... You can technically shoot and then MAP with all. Oh, you have to reload. Damn, that sucks. You can move. Yeah, you could have shot in the air, like, as a... You know what? I'll let you shoot into the air as an intimidation thing, if you wanted to do that. Yep, that's what he'll do. He's going to realize that no matter what he does in the shot, he's going to whiff it. He just does not have the angle. There's too much crowding. So instead, he aims up, and he fires over her head with the intent of just rolling breaking the wood. Uh, wood. Rolling intimidation. God, you guys are so... Oh, I like that. I did surrender, I told you. The fuck did you just say? Do it again. Um, She'll drop her weapons. On her turn. Are you gonna, really gonna knock me out like that? I mean, I like the pain, but... Oh, you can do it, I guess. Kaden. Uh, as soon as Kaden sees that she drops her weapons, he's... He is not the type of person to hit an unarmed person that says they're giving up, so he's just going to take a step back to ensure that he keeps that view of um, Yava. If anybody <clears throat> wants to strike at her and knock her unconscious, you can do that yep. as a flavor thing. Otherwise, she's just going to be like, Hi! Oh. Where is the kid? Ooh, do it again. I like that. That reminds me of Rolf so hard. Where's Rolf? Where's the kid? She, believe it or not, does not look at all scared with that intimidation. She actually seems to be, in a very perverse way, enjoying your anger and your just fury. Um, can you ask nicely? I am. Ooh, I like that. You're so cute. Hey, um, well, a couple of like, oh, but that just gives the game away. So easy. Don't you want to ask me how my day was going first? I know how your day's going. It's about to be much shorter. Are you going to hurt me? No. Oh, she slumps. Fine. I'll tell you, but only if you hurt me. You want me to hurt you? No. You're not worth the effort. She will dramatically just slump to the ground. Oh, you're so mean. Fine. I'll tell you. Rolf was like, hey. Give me any Varisians, and like half Varisians or any anyone you know. The kid looked Varisian. I know he had beautiful blue eyes, and that like kind of hit his Varisian heritage. But like, yeah. So he came, and a couple of those weird bird people came, and they took him. The bird what? If, does she mean the motherfuckers that fly around in the air, like those those mercenaries or whatever they are? No, no, no. They had these weird bird masks on or something. Plague masks? The doctors? Is that what they're called? Probably. Yeah, so they like took them. I don't know where, though. Probably wherever the bird people are. <laughs> What Verisians? Yeah, you'd make a great well, candidate. She like well, she can't no, move, but, but she'll stare at Yala. For for what? What do you what do you want them for? Oh, Rolf was like something about. Oh, he was just rambling on and on, and I, you know I love Rolf, but like 
something about them being immune and wanting to make sure they're no longer immune. One in 20 Varitians are immune to this blood veil or something like that. He just wanted some test subjects. She smiles. And where where he he is working with the doctors, you say? Hmm? Yeah. Hmm. All right. Well, does anyone else have any questions for our friend? Well, what what if you took me to Rolf? Because I'm full-blooded Verician. You could take me to him. I'd volunteer to help in your studies. Ooh. That's like a good idea. So where would we go? Just so I have a general idea of where we're going. There's a lot of security <laughs> and stuff. Oh, that's like, funny. I would have to take you. Oh, what did he say it was? Oh, I don't even remember. Was it the? Oh God, he came here to get the Varitians. I'm. You'll have to wait here for him to come again. Actually, why would he come again? He already took the Varitians. I can't take you to where he is. That Wouldn't just... he be really pleased if you were to found, find another one? So he gave you no plan. But if you were to stumble upon a Verishian, oh, you had no Rolf, way of knowing Rolf, where to contact Rolf, him. Rolf, 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 you silly boy. Here I have a Verishian on a platter, and you didn't tell me where you are. Ah, oh. where did you go, Rolf? She looks frustrated. Hmm. Uh, you I guys... see no further use for her. Oh. No further use. Hmm. Yeah, but she's not worth the ammunition or the bluntness on a blade. Let's take her in. And while if somehow, let's just say. The Queen's Guard sees her and stops us while we're taking her. Then we'll know who our real enemy is. Mayday, keep watch over her for a moment. Oh, that's a pretty uh, dog. Mayday's full, full growling. He's so pretty. Uh, I will uh, do another lay on hands, my second on Yahaba. Well, mm -hmm. Jasper runs in the room. He's been in here. So they took him to the places where the doctors are. Where where are the doctors in the city anyway? Everywhere. I, I don't know if it's all of the doctors that are in on this. Well, we don't know if it's all the doctors that are in on this. Didn't or if it's tell me to go to like a specific place to get cured or something like that earlier? Can I try and recall knowledge to remember? <laughs> yes, you certainly can. I think Alex would remember this the most because he was here for that. But uh, roll me recall. Oh, yeah, roll me recall. Oh, wait, I can do it for you if you want. You I'm to... already up. Okay. Natural 20. Aiden, do you remember this Hospice of the Blessed Maiden? Hospice of the Blessed Maiden. That's where you were told to take one of the... There was a random passerby that came up, and uh, Isabel was like, yeah, go there. Anybody else remember in character mm -hmm. or out of character? Really? Oh, I, I remember the name. Come, I remember there was an incident. I didn't remember the name at all. Okay, okay. Well, there is a giant makeshift hospital being set up in the center of Corvosa, where most of the doctors are being gathered here. In fact, I could swear... Is this not on your map? Tell me this is on your map. Yeah, oh, Okay, it is. There it is. Perfect. So let's go back to the Carowind Manor here. What are we doing, boys? Uh, I'm starting. I'm starting to pray for guidance for about ten minutes, unless we're going to take her immediately. Uh, Aiden's gonna keep interrogating her. Okay, 
you soon come to realize that intimidation doesn't work. She seems to really enjoy that. So. Uh, well, not really interrogate, just a very firm line of questioning. Yeah? Yeah, so it's mainly like, how many, how many of the doctors are compromised? How many of them are working for your master? Oh, uh, oh, I don't know. They, they, they just, two of them came and grabbed them. That's all I know. Probably all of them, if I'm, if, if, if it were up to me, but it's not up to me. Duh. Um, you can roll me a secret perception, Prince. Uh huh. Perception or religion? Our religion works too. So your master is he the one that fabricated this disease, or is he just enhancing it? My master seems to be helping along. Uh, Prince, this lady is clearly off her rocker in multiple levels. All right. Um, you don't get a divine kind of nudge one way or another, but either way would be a mercy, you think. Either ending her insane suffering and ramblings, or just turning her in and letting her be in a white room for the rest of her life. I'll leave it up to you. I prefer that she, uh, she have a chance at redemption, at least. But if she steps out of line, I'll be the first to end her. Oh, I'll be nice. I had my fun. What's Rolf look like? Rolf? Oh, that's a good question. Oh, uh, let me double check. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh, he's the most beautiful <laughs> man you've ever seen. With a little soul patch, because he's got a soul. Mm -hmm. So we're looking for a Charles Manson look-alike. Awesome. <laughs> I thought that was funny. I guess that was a full flat joke. Damn. That's rough. Uh, if she's... Uh, uh, I believe she has been disarmed, correct? Yeah, she's chilling on the floor. Just kind of lying there with no weapons on her. And I'm going to do what I have calculated to be the cruelest thing I can do to her. In this moment. Okay. Having prayed. No, don't touch me. Aww. That's rude. Oh, that was feeling so nice. Um, go ahead and grant or grab some of these items off of her, by the way, guys, if you want to grab it from the loot me there. I've got I got one more thing actually. How old is she? She looks in her mid twenties. Is she an elf or a half elf? Oh, uh, that's a good question. Uh, I'm gonna say Oh yeah, she's an elf. Sorry. It, she, I remember her age now. She's in the mid one eighties, but she's immature for her age. <laughs> As it says on the AP. Alright. Uh, well, she looks like she's in her 20s though right like she's like it's like that yeah. Vulcan kind of thing yeah. where it's like they'll be in their 70s but look 20 yeah um then he's just gonna be like look kid I've been around the block a few times to know people that really don't want to feel pain what's around the and block and you're one of them Curvosa life I like undead things. War, service, country, that sort of shtick. You know, the one where suffering just kind of comes with the pay packet. Oh, hell yeah. I love suffering. No, you don't. You see, if you loved suffering, you would never have surrendered. You wouldn't have dropped those blades. And I think you know that. I think that you really want out of this. There's a part of you in there that really wants out of this. This fucked up situation that, you, that you're in. But you don't know how. And dropping your weapons is your only way of trying to take back control. You gonna teach me, old man, how to get out of it? No, my teaching days are over. 
he taught me when I was 20 years younger, maybe. Okay. She shrugs. Jasper's currently having an intense conversation with Yabba, or at least attempting to. They took him to the Hospice of the Blessed Maiden? Is that where they took him? I, th I, don't, I don't know. I don't know. That's where the doctors are, and she said the doctors are the ones that took him. Why would the doctors take him? God. Okay. So what do we do? Do we just storm the hospice? No, obviously not storm it, but just, just, just give me a minute to think. I don't know. I don't know. I just figured this out. I mean, obviously... This goes all the way up to the top, right? Like this is this is the maidens, this is the doctors, this is this is the queen. Like this is all orchestrated. I, I don't really understand. Like, is she going to Conspiracy. kill everyone? I don't. Why would this? Why would the doctors, physicians, the ones you told me would help me, be capturing people? Are they like? Maybe they're trying to find a cure. But then, why would they kill all these nobles? No, they're not looking for a cure. The, the, the problem is, is that Varishians are immune and have, like, natural immunities and they're, they're trying to develop a disease that can get past that. Wait, what? That's fucked up. So, that's what I'm saying. Like, I, I don't understand. How, who is the queen going to rule over when she kills all of her subjects? Roll me recall know. knowledge, Java. Specifically, social warfare lore. In my honest opinion, I think it's because these nobles that are dead down here didn't support the queen. Yava. And she wants them gone. It starts clicking slightly. You realize how the... Well, I think you've discovered this before, but most of the disease seems to be only affecting the lower class. And then these nobles that were just murdered are like the trash nobles, basically. Or like, you know, the the wealthy, but like, kind of like, not more super, middle class. more middle class, exactly. You get a feeling if this was orchestrated by the queen, she's doing a little bit of a societal perch, maybe, you know, clean out the trash as it be, in her words. One more thing. Um, Aiden is actually going to go around to the group and he's going to offer out a cigarette to each of them, whether they take it or not is up to them. Yava will take it. Because God knows who's being at the Yes. Jasper will also take If need be, he'll want it for them. Um, I'll subtract a couple of cigarettes from you, Aiden. But yeah. Thank you, Aiden. Dergen, Dergen Caden, Priz. No, no thanks. Uh, I would prefer. Mm. I'm assuming you take one as well. No, oh, thank you. Durgan, do you want a cigarette? I have my own tobacco. I'm a dormant pipe. Mm, is anybody going to take yeah. this bow? What is it? A somebody with the bow, you can get Boston. a striking rune off of it, regardless. So, and if not, you can sell it. I think. Do we all have striking runes at this point? I would certainly hope so. And if not, you know, I think mm -hmm. so. Yeah, we can just sell it. I just don't want to leave it here. Okay. Uh... I might take my break now, as you guys you guys can figure out what you need to do. Everything okay, Summer? Yeah. Okay. Doing great. Good. Um, good. Good. Good plot twist, Pablo. I, I hope you liked it. I hope it's. It was good. 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 I'm happy. Uh, if you're happy, I'm happy. All right, I'll be back in. Um, I think I need to heat up some food, and it might take a little while. So I'll try to be back in 15, but it might be a little bit longer, slightly. Uh, yeah, I mean, I don't, I, I, I think I know, but because you, I, did you ever tell us that about your your son directly? No. Yeah. No. So now maybe Priz, because Priz was around. Priz mm -hmm. was around, especially when Yava and Jasper were an item, and then 
when Yava just bounced in the night. So, yeah, I don't know that it would take much for, for Priz to have guessed that something went down. Yeah. I, I, I haven't wanted to press, but I want to understand this child that we're after. Hmm. <clears throat> mm -hmm. is he is now the sole heir of the Elnessa fortune. So he's the only son and heir uh, who is going to inherit all their lands and all their money. And so he is the pride and joy of Lady Tatula and Lord Uberto. Anessa, who have tragically passed. That was they. They were. That was who was in the in the mm. party. Yes, they were downstairs. But that's not your interest, I don't think. It's certainly I... in his interest. It's it's in the boy's interest. Yes, I I know. I just. We'll, we'll get him back. That's, that's all I need. I just, that's all I need. Is that all Jasper needs too? Mm, who knows? Who knows what he needs or wants? Jasper's currently but, looking yes. sullen. But uh, if you address him, we're going to get that kid back. Then I'm going to take him out of the city. Like you told me to. Yes. Right? Right. Yes. Out of the city, away from here. And then we're going to have to find some sort of guardianship. But perhaps if I continue, if, perhaps if I help find a cure, that will be easy enough. And so Sebastian or Nessa, we will become guardians to him until he's old enough to take inherit his fortune. And take his lands. Hmm? That. It's n yeah. No. But. Mm. Hmm. Oh, what What are the al alternatives? How hmm? are we going to become his guardians? Or did they Did they leave us in their will? What? How How do we just steal that? The kid back. I don't know. It's a lot of paperwork. I'm confused. No, I'll think you. You just take the kid, take him, get him out of the city, and get him in a safe location. And don't fuck anything up. And then I'll take care of the rest. When have I ever yeah. fucked anything up, Yava? Yeah, all right. Let's not even start this. I'm not in the mood. Unfortunately, I believe goblins only have three fingers on each hand plus a thumb. So I'm, it's, I'm limited in my ability to count, Jasper. But if you would like, I can start. Hey, nobody asked you. Mm. And she, she hasn't even known you that long. And that's her opinion. Jasper looks a little red. He's pretty. He's already conflict, not conflicted. The, the word is like stressed by this whole ordeal. And he I'm looks like he's get this kid back. But I want to be clear: no one's stealing any kids. Of course not. He's. It's complicated. Mm. Maybe it would be less complicated if you just told him the truth. And then he can inherit his father's debts and his mother's. Listen, I paid that off. No, shut, shut up. And his mother's Verishian heritage. And he can work against both of those things for the rest of his life. Or he is set up to inherit riches and a title and power and land. And that's the best that we can do for him. Well... Maybe you should let him choose whether he wants to inherit a fortune or a family. No. I don't want to intrude, Java, but I believe you have another debt to pay. Yes! Get a hero point, Durgan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right. Uh... I'll get you your money. I don't have it on me. You could thank that one. For why I'm completely broke. 
He looks at you and smiles. Why it's your spur, my man? What? Can I see your pouch? My pouch? You mean this? He pulls out an empty rag. Perhaps I can help you out with because she owes me gold. She made a bet oh, to see if there was hey, any in... Following my footsteps, are we, Yava, now? It was a ridiculous statement. He said, I bet 50 gold pieces that at this noble party that there'll be piles of corpses being eaten by zombies. I took the bet. <laughs> it was a sure bet. You know what's funny as a DM when he said that last week? I was laughing so hard. So hard. And I couldn't say anything until I saved it. Uh, he, he Jasper looks at you. That's a, that's a good bet. I would have bet that. Yeah. See? Yeah. Wasn't that a reasonable thing? That's I reasonable. I 50 golds in my pocket. Now I'm How 50 golds in my pocket. How short, down. Yava? Um, I think I have seven gold to my name. You actually Which have. I, actually, I think that we just got paid out, didn't we? Yeah, you have 76 gold to your name. Oh. Not, well, to, not pay... to call you out. I forgot that we got paid last time. All right. I'll give, uh, I'll give. Jurgen his due. <laughs> this house feels like I'm evil now. Oh, God, I don't like it. Wait, how do you give money? Just drag those five fire? platinum pieces from your inventory to Jurgen's token. On the bottom there, where you see the platinum in your treasure. I have about 66 gold and plus another 50. Jesus Christ. There you go, Jurgen. You're rich. Hey, Jurgen. I'm rich. There is a sound effect for you. We're rich. 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 And he still has the damn plus one star. Yava, do you want me to do it? Yes, just do it. I can't figure it out. There you go, Durgan. You are 50 gold richer. Hey, that's five more platinum coins. Hey, Yava, I bet our kid's alive. Wait, no, that's a bad bet. Hold on. Hold on. No, he wouldn't say that. He wouldn't that's say a, that. He wouldn't say that. Oh, my God. <laughs> he wouldn't Jasper, say that. I don't, I don't think you my should do that. To count the number of times. <laughs> Jasper looks like he's trying to get a dumb bet in with Yava, but he thinks better of it. Um... Sorry, Summer. That's out of character. <laughs> <laughs> He'd also win that bet. Ooh, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Um, okay, well, uh, it is later in the day, so long rest. If you have any shopping you need to do, uh, remember, you cannot buy any healing potions or anything like that. In Everything's out of stock. That is healing materials, staff of healing, whatever you think has the healing trait it is not in stock in the city but do we need to do we need to yeah long rest and let's do a, do we need to do shopping anybody need to do shopping i know summer loves this um i still have the plus one starter lever i'm not sure if anyone can use it does anybody we need, need to a, take the rune off yeah does anybody need the plus one rune i took the plus one rune off of something else hmm I don't remember what it was. Kaden, do you need a plus one rune for your armor? Actually, you might be able to use studded leather, Kaden, because your dex is... No, you know. You, you, just... No, you don't. You, you need leather. Uh, Kaden, you could probably get the... Should we give it to Kaden, guys? Because he's a, he's a melee frontliner, right? I am. Yeah. So it would be 32 gold to... Tr no. Not 30. Yeah, 32 gold. 32 gold to transfer that plus one from that subtle leather to your leather, Caden, and a day. Uh, but that depends if you guys want to wait a day or no. I mean, I don't think it's a good idea we wait a day. Anything can happen in a day. I don't I don't I don't think we're gonna wait a full day for a rescue operation. Mm -mm. No, so I bet there. Yeah. Would it slow me if I put that studded armor on? It would not give you any benefits, I think, is the because it, it has a three dex modifier cap and your dex is four, which means that you, it's not going to help you. Unfortunately. Uh, well, no, if it's plus one, it'll 
if he as long as he can use like as long as he can reach the dex cap any armor without uh the armor check penalty so as long as he got the strength which i think is 14 okay let me double he does have the strength let me see let me let me put the studded leather on you caden and let's see how much it changes your ac should be oh should yeah be it does give you one ac there you go yeah. you can just wear the studded leather and you should be good caden yeah the the, the mm -hmm. sort of very very simple secret background math is that all armors that are not heavy armor if you max their decks out, we'll give you the same bonus of uh, plus five. Okay, and I'll sell your old leather for one gold and give you that there, then, Caden. Cool! You, have... you got a little extra AC there, Caden, so not bad at all. Um, so and who then... all does not have a plus one for their armor, just out of curiosity? Uh, Aiden doesn't. Durgan then... does... Yava doesn't. Yeah. And Isabel probably doesn't either. So all the, all, but but the the main frontliners all do. Okay, yeah. So Durgan, Caden, and and Priz. Priz have one. That's good. That's decent. Okay. I like to still have the glue bomb. You still have the glue bomb? Yeah. Fuck it. You can use it someday. I don't know. Uh Okay, so we're going to long rest. I'm assuming we're resting for the night at our own individual apartments to, so we can storm the Blessed Maiden. Or were we storming tonight with no spell slots? I don't know. How many spell slots are we now? How, how are we feeling? I think Yava already long rested, but Yava... I did. You told me to long I rest. Know. I know. I, I, I did. And then I started doing all my ritual blah, 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 blah stuff for the morning. That's up to you, Yava. Would you be willing to wait till the morning to rescue your kid? No? Probably not. Probably not. What spells do we have missing then? Let me see here. Uh, I have... Oh. Well, I don't know now because I long rested. I know you cast a um, blindness and then I think you had two third rank missing and everything else yeah. was mm -hmm. full. Yeah. So well we're just and I, Oh, and I did a soothe, a second or first level soothe on myself. First level soothe. So we'll get rid of another first rank. Thank you, Yava. Um And I did I do Phantom Pain? No. I did one more. Distracting chatter. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's it. Distracting that's it. chatter. You did do distracting chatter. What level is that? Oh, third. Level yeah, three. Yeah, so you only have one third rank left. Yeah? Mm hmm So, because you did blindness as well. And you had one missing, because I remember when I leveled you up. Okay, and no second ranks or... Well, that should be good enough. You're missing a few spells here. Um. So let's... This evening... I mean, yeah? We can wait. I, hopefully we can wait 20 minutes. So that I can refocus. No, you guys yeah, can definitely, definitely twenty minutes. Twenty minutes and heal up to full should be good enough, but no long resting. And then we'll storm. Are we just getting straight to the hospice then? Because then we'll call the session and start that next week with everybody here. Yeah, hopefully. Yeah, I think, I think so. okay. yeah, that's the plan. Okay. Uh then with people gone and you know a new chapter a new chapter, quote unquote, emerging. Um <laughs> level up to level seven in Path Builder. Guys, let's do that now. I know it's quick, but uh, halfway through the hospice, you'll be leveling up. So let's do that right now. That way we don't have to spend too much time next session. Level in Path Builder, but not in Foundry. In Path Builder, not in Foundry. In Path Builder, not in Foundry. What's the session fee? Uh, I'll charge a Normal. little less for today. 2250 $22. if that's okay. Yeah. Uh, if you guys want to send that over. Um, and I'll stop recording here. Thank you for watching YouTube. Like and subscribe. Bye.